Hi guys, so for today's video, hold on, let me set you down. Today I'm gonna be getting my life together. I have been congested for the past few days and I've literally done nothing. I've been sitting on my bum and not doing anything. So I have a lot that I wanna get done. I wanna make content today. I just got off a call and right now I'm just doing a portfolio for my past experience and my past work on Canva, which is, I love Canva. I just brushed my hair and I'm like trying to look decent for today especially for this video so I'm gonna get ready a little bit I don't want to get ready too much because I'm gonna be blowing my nose because I have been sitting on my bed for the past few days I have a lot that I want to do Right now, I'm getting ready. I just finished eating some lunch. I'm glad I can finally breathe out of my nose though, so, cause that is the worst when you literally can't breathe through your nose. I did my makeup on Saturday and it was the worst idea or it was kind of a waste of time Not really the worst idea, but it was a waste of time because I kept blowing my nose like 24 seven. just took a bunch of content pictures for a story that I have to do. It's for e.l.f. Cosmetics and Magic Links as well, so I'm working with them on a couple of projects, which is really, really exciting. I got sent a bunch of products, and then this mascara, you guys. This mascara is so nice. I love it. I love how my lashes look. I literally don't have lashes, but like, for someone with Asian eyelashes, like, it's pretty good. I'm just so excited to try all of their things. I'll show you guys what I got right now. As I showed you guys, I got the Big Mood Mascara. And then starting here, I have the e.l.f. Mint Melt Cleansing Cloud. And it basically wipes away all of your makeup with just water. I feel like something reusable like this is very much needed. I have the Camo Concealers. This one's Hydrating and then 16 Hour. They're both in light beige. This one is really, really good. Again, I wanted to try the Poreless Putty Primer. I've heard so many good things about it. And then there's the Putty Bronzer. This one is in Honey Drip. And then I got the Enhancing Lash and Brow Serum. I was really in need of a new toner. So I decided to try this one. I got a new eyelash curler because I definitely felt like I needed another one. I have the Holy Hydration Eye Cream. I have the Ultra Precise Brow Pencil in Brunette. And then I got the H2O Eyeliner Pen in Jet Black. I got a blending brush. And then last but not least is their Camo CC Cream. So these are the products I got from Elf. I'm so excited to try everything. I just finished up on working on my portfolio. I feel like it looks really good. Okay, so this is the portfolio that I've been working on. There's like even a video, but I'm not gonna play that because of copyright. But yeah, so these are just really awesome brands that I've worked with and I feel like it would be awesome for future opportunities. It's just really good to showcase what I've worked on. So I have that done for today, which is good. Um, I feel like I should also be writing this stuff down, so have that done. Now that I'm finished with e.l.f. content, I really need to put the box outside so I can throw it out or recycle. Recycle, of course. And then I have this Ipsy box that I also need to put away because I'm pretty much done with the content as well. This is probably not the cutest angle, but it's fine. I'm all finished with Ipsy content. If you guys didn't know, I'm part of Ipsy, so like they send me their items every single month which is awesome i love ipsy i've been with them for years now and they're literally amazing i love them i always separate like the ones that i want to keep and the ones that i want to give away to like my mom or my sisters or like family members or something and this month is super cute it's like stay golden theme and then this goes in the recycling Just came from Target. Just needed a couple of things. I realized that Target doesn't even have sourdough bread, and that's very important for my everyday life. So I'm gonna go get some at Trader Joe's, and then that's the last stop. Oh. 
So it's been a couple of hours. I feel like I got a couple of clips, but we did end up going to the store. I just really needed sourdough bread. I know that sounds crazy, but I needed sourdough bread. And I realized Target doesn't sell sourdough bread, which is crazy. So I literally just went to Trader Joe's. We ended up getting like just honestly a couple of boring things from Target. I'm going to shower really quick, wash my hair, and like just get rid of all of the sickness. Are you guys like that too when you're sick? You literally just want to shower like everything because you just want to get rid of the sickness. That's literally me. Also, I really wanted to show you guys my new phone case. It's from Casetify and it's so cute. I was thinking of actually doing my nails like kind of inspired by this color, but then I realized I don't really have an orange. I'm so excited because Casetify actually sent me a couple of their cases. They're not sponsoring this video or anything. I just really wanted to show you guys all of the cases so here they are oh my gosh i'm so excited it came in this big freaking box and they sent me all of these cases they sent me six cases obviously i have the orange and pink one here there's the heart one these angel ones because if you guys didn't know i have an angel tattoo now so i'm obsessed with anything angel i have a pink cow print this really pretty design as well it has like a butterfly and hearts and just a bunch of symbols and then this one right here i think it's a collab with honey it just has a bunch of cool sayings like vibin and thriving i Iconic and stuff like that. So I'm so excited. I kind of want to change up my case now I will be going to the beach in a couple days So I'm thinking I'm gonna go with this one because it's more of a beach theme I've actually had case defies cases before and it was honestly right when I got this phone This is the iPhone 10 s i believe and honestly right when i changed my caseify case to something else that's when it cracked a lot and that's just because caseify honestly has the best protection ever out of all cases that i've tried all of the cases that i chose i made sure to choose the one with the ultra impact case these ultra impact cases are engineered with a two-layer construction called chi tech chi tech material is drop test approved for up to 6.6 feet and caseify is super customizable you can literally put your name you can change the color of the case and it can literally match your style or your phone the ultra impact and impact phone cases are made with 50 percent recycled materials from upcycled phone cases and it's shipped to you in 100 percent compostable packaging and the ink as well is eco-friendly and another cool thing is that they have antimicrobial coating which eliminates 99 percent of bacteria which is awesome because of covid and everything she is all inside i love it she looks cute i will be drop testing this so you guys can see how amazing these cases are but i'm gonna show you what cracks have already been there okay just remember that i have a screen protector and a lot of the cracks are from the screen protector as well here are oh it also looks dirty again so most of these are from the screen protector so this is like pretty bad just remember these cracks right here all from my screen protector as you can see this one is obviously from my phone sadly and then of course these are from my screen protector and then this one at the bottom right here I don't know if you guys can be able to see it but this is actually from my phone I'm going to make sure you guys will see that there are no new cracks when I drop test these I am terrified but we're gonna do this it's kind of crooked but it's okay I'm dropping it you probably can't even see it but here she goes same cracks as last time she is all good it scared me a little bit but she's fine she's fine she's still working i'm just so excited for all these new cases i just got out of the shower i actually am gonna try the new toner that i got from elf i'm excited to try it it has a very interesting scent it literally reminds me of like lemons oh wait does this have lemon it has something like that because i think it's like a brightening toner 
I've also been trying out this oil, which is from Bush Balm. It's called the Bermuda Oil, and it actually has been working slowly but surely. It's supposed to brighten dark spots. I follow this influencer named Delaney Childs. If you guys know who I'm talking about, you know. But she promoted this, and I was like, wait, it's not as expensive, and I kind of want to just try it out. So I've been trying it out for like two weeks now, and I kind of see a difference. It's not like a drastic difference, but I can definitely tell that my underarms are getting pretty light. They're get like lighter than before. It says to use it at least two to three minutes after you get out of the shower because that's when your pores are open. Every time I get out of the shower, I literally try and put it on right Right away because I feel like that's pretty smart like your pores are open so when you apply the oil like it really just gets in there <laughs> now I'm going to focus on my drawers and putting all of this makeup in the drawers and then just close that up and I'm clean Majority of my things are clean now. I feel like I have tomorrow planned. I have content to post tomorrow, so I need to make sure that's scheduled and I have that ready to go. Upload my Princess Holly video that needed to go up a while ago. And then next week is another story. Right now, I'm just going to make sure that this video goes live tomorrow morning and just make sure everything looks good. So that is it for today's video. Thank you guys so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe if you're not already. Make sure to check out all of the links in the description down below. I love you and I really hope you enjoyed watching this. Make sure to give it a big thumbs up for the algorithm and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!